I honestly keep everything. Too many things. And this is what I wore, you know, when I went to the bathroom in New York. I remember the stupidest details of everything, but they all have a story. Maybe I should write it down and do a fashion book. Two thousand three Michael Kors show. I loved it so much because I didn't have to wear a bra. This is so comfortable. I get to wear something this comfortable to a fashion show. I actually want it back. <laughs> Reality tour two thousand and four. This dress was made by Roberto Cavalli, and he really knew how to dress my body, especially for stage. By the end of the tour, and it kind of broke in multiple places, but it, it hung in all summer. 2004 MTV VMAs, styled by Rachel Zoe. I, I really loved this dress. I loved wearing the short hair with it. A different vibe than most people do at the VMAs. My very first role, Daisy Duke, me into Narciso Rodriguez. We picked out this periwinkle blue color. I felt like a movie star. 2005, I definitely was in my element. I am a jeans girl, so if I can dress up jeans in any way, it's gonna be with a corset and a big flower. 2005 ESPY Awards is probably one of my all-time favorite dresses. It's Oscar de la Renta. I had never worn anything fit and flare like this before. I remember I could hardly breathe. My favorite part is the accessory, the corsage. A Y2K top. It's very scandalous because you could see my lace bra. And now it's like so normal. 2006, this was press for my last pop record that I did, which is a long time ago. I had short hair, I just chopped it all off. I was going through a divorce, I just wanted to wear something that was very me, and then I wore a Jessica Simpson collection boot. I just thought it was fun that you could fold them over. You know, maybe that'll come back one day, but you know, it's a little renaissance. 